Hi, I'm Jeanette Crawford, and I just wanted to take a minute today to share some things about myself that you may not know. Like many of you, I've been through some devastating pits in my life. As a young child, my parents divorced, and as a result of the divorce, I had all of this emotional baggage in my life. I felt rejected, I felt unloved, and I had a huge sense of rejection. And my whole life and the years to come came out of that sense of rejection. I felt overwhelmed, I felt insecure, I felt very inferior. And then at the age of 17, I gave my life to the Lord. And I was excited because, wow, I found the love that I'd been looking for. I found the acceptance. And I got excited because I thought, hey, I'm never going to have another problem the rest of my life. Well, what I found is, as a Christian, it's not that you never go through a problem, but it's that you have the solution to your problem that go everywhere with you, and that's the Lord. When my daughter was just two weeks old, my husband and I separated, and my husband moved out when my daughter was two months old. Then again, all of this sense of rejection and anger and bitterness, all of this emotional baggage came rushing back, and I felt overwhelmed. I felt like my life was a deep, dark pit, and I didn't feel like I had any way out. There were days where I was just hanging on by a fingernail. My big goal for the day was to get up, out of bed, take a shower, and put my makeup on. Maybe you've experienced some of those days where you're just so overwhelmed, you don't know which end is up. And God began to teach me that if I didn't quit in the pit, He had all power to turn the situation around. If I would just grab a hold of the rope of hope. The rope of hope was God's word. And if I hung on to the rope of hope and I didn't quit, He'd bring me out. And that's what He did. He did it for Job. You know, the life of Job. Job went through so many things and it really seemed unfair. That's what I said. God, it doesn't seem fair that I'm going through these things, Lord. But just like Job, when Job began to pray for his friends and forgive those who hurt him and wounded him, God turned it around. And when I began to pray and forgive those that had hurt me, God began to turn my situation around. And just like Job, God gave him double for his trouble. I can stand here today and honestly say that I am a blessed woman, and God has blessed me and given me double for my trouble. And God's no respecter of persons. What he did for me, he'll do for you. Maybe today you're in a pit. You feel like life is overwhelming. Well, don't quit in the pit. God has the power to turn the situation around. I've written a book called Don't Quit in the Pit, and it's for people just like you who have been through things just like me. God did it for me, and if you don't quit, God will do it for you too. He is not a respecter of persons. Grab a hold of the rope of hope today and be determined not to quit. Danette Crawford's book, Don't Quit in the Pit, is a must-read book for all who desire to get out of the pits of life and experience the peaks of victory. Order your copy today at don'tquitinthepit.com or purchase a copy anywhere books are sold. Official release date, March 9, 2010.